Okay, how many isomeric ester have the molecular formula of this? Okay, so do remember, we are talking about ester. Okay, so ester is supposed to be R, C, double bond, O, then O, then there will be another R. Okay, so this is going to be ester. Okay, so if we want to find out, okay, how many isomeric ester that can be uh, formed, so four carbon, so I'll draw one, two, three. Okay, I put O and then carbon here, double bond O. Okay, then this one, if I put the H over here, okay, if I put the H over there, so you can see, okay, this is going to be this. And then the R, one of the R, I'm replacing it with uh, H. Okay, so um, it, uh, it can be, okay, it can be. So if you have this, okay, this is going to be one of the isomer, okay, one of the isomer. So we need to find out, okay, different combinations of this, okay. So what are the different combinations that I can have for this is, um, so what I do, okay, now I bring that C over here, okay, I bring the C. Maybe what I can do is may, uh, I break the C. Maybe I can put like this C, C, O. I still maintain H. I put the C here. Okay, this is going to be one isomer. Okay, now let's try to bring the C somewhere else. Okay, so to bring it to the right. Okay, so if I bring it to the right, so two carbons here, O. C double bond O, I put the C here, okay? This is going to be another isomer, okay? Another isomer. Is that all, okay? No, you can bring the C, you can put it here. Another C here. Now, some students, they find, okay? They will find, sir, I think, uh, don't you think that this one, okay, and this one the same, okay? Don't you think it's the same? No, they are not the same, okay? You see here, there are two carbon compounds attached to oxygen atom, but there is only one carbon compound attached to oxygen. This is going to be two carbon compounds attached to the carbon that has double bond O. There's only one carbon compound attached to the carbon that has double bond O. So they are different, okay? They are different. So to answer this question, how many isomeric ester have the molecular formula, okay, of C4H8O2, okay, the answer will be, okay, you have one, you have two, okay, you have three, and you have four, okay? There is no other way or other combination that you can have this, okay? Therefore, okay, the answer will be uh, C, four, okay? So I will...